I sure was of no surprise that he was on my short list, you know, the infamous short list. And uh, he was pretty high on it, to tell you the truth. Because I know firsthand that Ernie Kemp can coach, I know he can recruit, I know that he graduates his players, I know that he molds men out of young, young men and, and teaches them more than just basketball. I know he's loyal, I know he's great in the community, and most of all I know he's a winner. So when we wrapped up our discussion just a few days ago, and I, I knew I was going to offer the job, I, I told Ernie, and I'll never forget it, Ernie, I've got something that you want me, and you've got something I want me. Let's get it done. Ladies and gentlemen, 18th basketball coach, Washington State University, Ernie Kemp. Thank you. It's a great day for me. I'm hoping it's a great day for you, and especially I hope it's a great day uh, for all of you players sitting over there. And I say that because I've missed the game tremendously these last four seasons. I didn't go retire on the beach, and I didn't go pull off the golf clubs. I'm not a great golfer anyhow. But what I did was went to work to rebrand Ernie Kent. I went to work to um, become one of you out there in the media. And one of my favorite sayings that I realized I'm going to miss when I got up this morning is, I miss my makeup. Yeah, because there's nothing like getting airbrushed makeup sprayed on. I'm kind of envious of you ladies ask somebody to put your makeup on you before you go on stage. So when I looked in the mirror this morning, I said, oh. But uh, I won't tell you that I covered my eyebrows to, to get me to this image and everything, but she does do a good job with it. For coaching, you need to make sure you have the support of the administration and the support of the athletic director that need to be in place and that they get it. They understand how tough our jobs are All right, with, with social media, with recruiting, uh, everything that goes into it. Coaches are play, paid an enormous long, amount of money, but they earn every penny of it for what they have to go through. When I went around and saw some of those coaches in my profession and what it had done to their bodies, then you understand how hard these jobs are, and they are very difficult jobs. So. When I looked at Bill and saw what he was starting to do here and saw this duplication process coming about, I want to be a part of that because I know where it's going and I know where we went to when we did it before at Oregon. You know, it's my it's my belief that you step over the dollars to get the nickels. Uh, you got to invest and, and uh, to get results. I'm extremely compassionate about the young men that I have an opportunity to lead as well too. A part of our success, our style of play, our energy, it will be centered around how well we connect each other from a compassionate perspective. We, take, we go on retreats. We spend a lot of time together as men, understanding what it takes to communicate and be successful. Uh, do, do, do you know any of the details of that rollover? That, that can, is it a one-year rollover based yeah, on certain? Yeah, the way it's written, the way I like to do it is uh, they go into the season with five, and then uh, when it's over, there's a 30-day period that I evaluate and decide whether I want to add another year. So, so, and, and, and to tell you the truth, with Bernie at Oregon, we, we had a couple of uh, off years, and I didn't roll. Hmm. And I'll never forget that. He says, I'll, I'll earn that back. And that was uh, 07 when we won the Pac-10 Pac uh, tournament and went to the Elite Eight and lost to Florida. And it was disgusting, so he got that year back. <laughs> The, the winning will come and it'll take care of itself, but as you build this, I always tell people make sure they embrace, embrace the process, because it is a process from getting me here, to learning the team, to teaching, to growing, to meeting people, that's all a process. Embrace it, be a part of it, be enthused about it, and let's get where we need to get to.